it's Cece and first off I just want to say happy June it is June and I'm super excited this is one of my favorite months and it's about that time of the year that we all like to spend time by the pool or swim and stuff like that so that is where this video is coming from I recently went to the beach where I live quotation marks it's a lake but it has the beachy feel the sand the seashells all that fun stuff so I wanted to film a essentials for you guys and this could be for the pool, for the beach, whatever and you guys will also get to see what I take with me and all of that good stuff. So with that being said, I am just going to get started. So this is my beach bag and the reason why this is it is because it's big enough to carry me and Jeff's stuff but it has a pocket right here. And this one's made for traveling though, like there's the handles and then the wheels are down there. It has a pocket on this side and yeah. So moving on with the essentials, you will want to bring a towel to dry off with if you get into the water. You will also need a beach towel to land, whether it's by the pool or not, because you could always put this down so it's not hot, like the seat's not hot under you or whatever. And I really like this beach towel. People with black hair tends to attract the sun more. So, with that being said, I definitely need to keep it protected because my hair's already dry and... Uh, the sun will make it drier and I did not want that so I bring a hat with me and this is really good too because you don't want the sun on your hair and also you do not want the sun on your face so this just protects your face basically and of course you want to have your swimsuit this is the swimsuit I brought with me. It's really pretty. I like the color. It's like a coral color and that's just what it looks like. The back looks like that. And for bottoms, I need to buy bottoms with these. These bottoms I have had forever. This is what they look like. They're just shorts and I thought these two colors went okay together so I was like, you know, yellow. Cover up in case you're going somewhere afterwards or you just are tired of just being in your bathing suit so this is my favorite cover-up at the moment it is this dress that you guys seen in the intro and it's really really pretty and long I love it because it's a neutral color and it has a pop of color at the bottom next you want to protect your little eyeballs so you have your sunnies and whoa these ones are really dirty now on to all the other stuff this, every girl I think needs one of these type of things. This is my Betsy Johnson, I don't know what to call it, like a mini clutch. I use it as a mini wallet, so this is basically what I put my wallet and stuff in because we do go places after we go to the beach or lake or pool, whatever. So in here I have my ID and debit card, a hand lotion, my phone, and a hair tie and some bobby pins and of course if you want to listen to some music on your phone or iPod you want to bring some headphones because you could just tune out the world and be in your own little zone now for the stuff that is in here okay uh, okay might as well show you guys the bag. This is a Betsy Johnson makeup bag. I love this bag. It's called their Schools in Bloom. It is a lotion because after you get out the pool, you want to lotion up. So this is the Bali Mango Triple Moisture Body Cream. And then, like I said, if you're going somewhere afterwards, you need to smell good. You don't want to smell like chlorine or lake or sunscreen. And this is the one that I chose because it is summery and I do not have the mini version of this so yes I did bring the full one it's the pink spring break coconut mango body mist I also have this because I have heard beauty gurus rave about this so I decided to pick it up because um, Jeff gets sunburnt really easy and it's just like really refreshing and I put it on because you know your skin's hot and 
This is the Hawaiian Tropics Silk Hydration in Coconut Papaya. And it has aloe vera, so if you are sunburned, it gives you like a cooling sensation and it soothes it for you. Wet ones, and they're just wipes. Those came in handy too to like get all the sand and all that off of your hands. And then I have a wide tooth comb for brushing my hair or combing my hair after we're, before we're getting ready to leave. A waterproof mascara, and this is the Revlon Lash Potion by Grow Luscious. If you guys want to know my first impressions on this, I have a first impressions video if you guys want to check it out. And then, of course you need a deodorant because you don't want to stink. Oh yeah. And this is just a cheap Lady Speed Stick Travel one. Then of course you have to have sunscreen. But this is the Block Up 50 Sport Sunscreen. Broad Spectrum with Aloe Vera. And it's water resistant for 80 minutes. Balm that has SPF in there. And this one is the only EOS lip balm that has SPF in it. And it is the one in Lemon Drop. And of course, some blotting papers if your skin's oily. My skin is oily, so being out in the sun makes it more oily. So these were a lifesaver. And then I have a hand sanitizer. The last thing in here is some gum. I'm actually going to get one right now. And the last essential besides flip-flops, reading essentials. And I don't like to bring books, but I do like to bring magazines. So these are just two of the 17 magazines. I love Lucy Howe. She is like my idol. So yeah, that is all of my essentials. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Got some ideas of what to bring with you guys to the beach or the pool. And I will see you guys later. And I hope you guys have a wonderful week. And thank you so much for watching my videos. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.